Okay, I'm live again. Um, so what I was saying before my stream ended was I am playing through professional um, for the first time. I did play a little bit off stream. I got to the lake, not past the lake, and we are going to uh, start the new game from where we left off during the first stream. And we had to complete the game in... Um, seven hours to unlock the Chicago sweeper all right so let's try this again um, I do not have the webcam enabled today I'm not really feeling that well so I'm just gonna keep it off it's lagging a little bit So, my professional, I got to chapter three, um, but we're just going to load this one. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice training punishing missions nearly killed me but at least I kept my mind off everything if I could just forget what happened that night the pain even for a second this time it can be different it has to So tell me, Yankee, why did you come to this horrible place? As close to nowhere that I've ever seen. Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure you boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> well, maybe he did. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here, and it's been that way for a while now. Well then, should be just another day in the office, right? Mm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. <laughs> your calls, huh? I'll be right back. Yeah. Qué frío. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so in order to get the A rank, we do have to kind of pick up the pace a little bit. Um my gone. first playthrough, I got 15 hours for my first uh, 
Oh, shit. I lost my train of thought. Anyway, it took me 15 hours to be on my first playthrough, but I was also kind of fucking around a lot, taking it all in. And I was in the shooting booth for probably a good uh, <laughs> three of those Anyone hours. Home? But we're starting off with powerful weapons and this is not good. And we know what we're doing, so it shouldn't take too long. Uh, I think beating it in seven hours is for sure doable. but we don't really need to talk to him right now. Kind of just lurking over there in that corner. Not really too worried about these people. Well, I didn't want to get the shit out of this cabin, so I might have to eliminate them. You're not getting up from that one, are you? So I saw on the internet there's a quick way around this. You could shoot the bell and just bypass all of this, which would save us a good solid 10 minutes. Oh. Of course I'm gonna grab by this. I, of course I'm just gonna get absolutely fucked right here. Let's see if it works. It's supposed to be over there somewhere. I don't fucking see no bell. Oh, there we go. I guess it does work. Huh? Alright, so we're gonna use that time. Pick up everything. And this is not a speed run by any stretch of the imagination. I am just going to kind of kind of um, work my way through it a little bit quicker than I did last time. So not a whole lot of sightseeing, just try to get through the game. Seven hours is, it's definitely doable. That is definitely not a hard task. Hey, are they back? What the fuck? Alright, so I'm just going to pick up everything that I can. And we do come back to this area later, so it's not... Like, I'm never going to get these some of these items, but... We just want to be stocked up. Oh, 
All right. So I'm gonna come over here. Oh wow, that didn't need to happen. Literally, there's there's not even a fight going on, but the cow still has to die. It's kind of fucked up. So I do want to, during this uh, playthrough, I do want to try to get as much money as possible. Uh, because the goal, obviously, as the title suggests, we are aiming to get the entire, or we're aiming to get the Chicago typewriter. Oh, I forgot about this guy. Uh, we're aiming to get the Chicago typewriter, so I want to have enough money to upgrade it. Alright, this is all I'm going to get over here. Treasure over here we can pick up. There it is. Uh, one thing to note about professional is there are no, um, Auto saves. So it wouldn't hurt to make sure you save often. Now, if you're going for an A rank, that's fine. But if you're going for a um, S plus rank, you can only save 15 times. God damn it. Hey Ada Wong, welcome to the stream. Really need that yellow herb or max out on health. All right. So there's the last medallion. We're gonna fight the uh, pighead dude. Cow head, not pig head, whatever the fuck it is. Oh fuck! I don't really want to see what that hammer feels like on professional. Oh, oh yeah, that's what I want to do. Stab him in the fucking neck. Kind of some weak ass treasure, I'm not gonna lie. Here on your third playthrough. Have you played uh, professional yet? This is uh, only my second. I unfortunately haven't had enough time during the week to play it. Busy week at work. It's a quarter in, or it's a year in for a couple clients, so it's been busy. But 
back on the ground. I'm going to do this today and weather permits, I'm going to continue it tomorrow. I think if I'm going to complete this game in seven hours, it's not going to be any more than three streams. Uh, and then after that, I'm going to, I'm going to um, work on, I have a couple video ideas that I can get, get out. But I'm going to work on the weapon showcases as soon as I possibly can, but I need to get some more experience with this game under my belt before I can do that. So, getting a feel for a couple things. But, I mentioned, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, uh, but I was going to do this playthrough off stream, and I did play a little bit up to the lake part, so about 40 minutes. But I decided, fuck it, might as well do it uh, on stream. This isn't going to be my quote-unquote professional walkthrough. This is just me kind of playing through the game on professional. Once I kind of get more of the game... Once I understand the game better, I can feel confident making something like that. My game did crash last time I was in this tunnel, so hopefully it doesn't do that. Because that took me back quite a bit. Last time we saved was in the... Before we fought the cowhead. I like that. Well, normally for me, when it comes to difficulty spike, um, the game doesn't really get too hard for me until the castle. So I'm wondering, and I'm talking about OG Resident Evil. So I wonder if it's going to kind of pick up. Because so far, as far as I got in the village, about, about an hour or so, um, it doesn't feel too terrible. Now, I understand what you mean about not being much of a tryhard. I, f I feel that. Uh, I do like playing on the harder difficulties, but I'm definitely not like a, uh, you know, pro or anything. Oh, God. All right. Body armor is uh, pretty nice. Now, it's kind of funny that they want you to beat the game in seven hours for a uh is that in here what the fuck it wants you to beat the game in seven hours for a rank and you can do that with a new game plus with all your weapons from your previous load but seven hours is not really a long time and then for for s plus rank which i don't even remember what the hell you get from the s plus plus rank on professional you have to do it on new game in a five and a half hours, so it's like pretty big difficulty jump. Now I've seen some people on YouTube making guides and stuff for it already, but I'm not gonna watch any of those until I figure like until I do it myself because I don't really want. I, I kind of like to find my own way. Ah shit. Am I missing something? Yeah, I am. Oh, come on. He's got to grow up with me. These things are so easy to miss. time have we played so far 14 minutes that ain't bad this the place that um village skip it's pretty nice addition it's gonna make speedrunners happy as a matter of fact that's how I found out about it I was watching some speed speedrun um hardcore place? I think it's hardcore and he went up there and shot that thing But my uh, B rank on 
my first playthrough was kind of left a lot to be desired, so I, I want to kind of grind through the game a couple times to get some better ranks to unlock some of the things that I missed. Like the hand cannon, you need an S plus on hardcore. So I could have got that, but that hurts, you, know, you know, took my time. Like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? You know, those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just some timing then, huh? All right. I think the hardest part about um, professional is going to be 15 saves. That's going to be pretty difficult. Sacrificial lamb. Shit, I took my gear. Oh, I didn't pick up the knife. Whoops. I wasn't paying any attention. I should be able to just run past him, but who knows. So I'm not really worried about killing them, but I do want to kill the rats for the challenge. Um, Who's that? Because I do, I want to save up as much money as I can, but also I want to save up as much uh, spinos as I can. I know one of the fucking things over here is for the rats. For good reason, too. These are big fuckers. Alright, I think the other one's in here. Come on. Bro. Stop fucking moving. No, not yet. There's a thing over here, isn't there? I am gonna get the treasure map. I think that's worth the uh, spinals. Spinals, spinals. Good stuff, stranger. I got something new for you. You pleasant travel. The ones that keep getting me are the fucking um. The fuck did I miss back here? Really? I've been waiting for you. You got them all with a knife? Uh, I guess I, it's just a skill skill issue. Yeah, Resident Evil 5 was kind of chill when it came to your... Just uh, letting you kind of use whatever you wanted on professional. But to be fair, on professional, it was like a one fucking hit kill, and if you weren't playing with somebody, that, that meant you were gonna die because eight or not Ada, uh, Sheva was kind of useless. I have something I think you like. But I did like how they just let you run I? into professional with all your weapons and stuff. Yeah, there's still quite a bit uh, I made YouTube videos you studied the blade. Well, I can't argue with that. I, I'm such a, I, I have a lot to learn because I didn't know there was three fucking knives in this game and I upgraded my first one all the way.
Oh, fuck. Professional was a co-op difficulty. You're convinced you made it that way. Yeah, you're probably right. Because, oh no, you're not doing this. You're not, oh, okay. Well, he took care of that for me. Where did they, oh. Where's all the dynamite guys at? Come on, light it. Light it for me, buddy. No, oh, I didn't mean to kill you. Did I hear what I... Alright. I'm getting a little too cocky. I forget that I'm trying to do this in a timely manner. Hang on. I need to catch up with the chat. Um, I had some bad experiences with, oh my gosh, with Resident Evil 5, God, you motherfucker, uh, with the Sheva AI, uh, I mean, it's kind of really hit or miss. The part where you go and fight Wesker and Jill on Professional is a fucking nightmare because, uh, it, you get one tap, literally one bullet from Jill will put you in critical and then Sheva will be across the fucking map doing God knows what. And, um, yeah, it just was not very pleasant. But with co-op, it was a little different. I mean, you had the partner to rely on, but it still didn't make it. I think, I think that part in general on Resident Evil 5 was the hardest, uh, part of the game, truthfully. Yeah, Emily, you would know that that Jill Wester fight's a nightmare because, uh, you kept letting me die. There's a lot of shit going on outside this window, and I'm really curious what it is. So I did, um, at the end of my stream, when I finished the game, I got a little salty that the mercenaries wasn't in there. I didn't know at the time that, damn, I left the fucking treasure back there. I didn't know at the time that they were planning on. Releasing it later. I knew they were releasing it, but I just kind of figured it would be with the game. I saw a trailer for it. A couple weeks before the game came out. But anyway, Mercenary comes out next Friday, so. <clears throat> Who are you hiding from, my guy? Oh no. You are not doing that. Out of the way. And I know the PRL is not in the game either, but my guess, like what you said, is they might add that or maybe even something else because I can't imagine that they're not going to bring it back for one reason. I think my inventory is so fucking out of control right now. One reason why I'm thinking that is because the Matilda is not a special weapon in this game. So, you know... There's already one missing right there. 
I would have a feeling that they're going to give you something for beating mercenaries. Um, I have no idea what... Uh, I left behind some pistol ammo. I have no idea what that would be. And this is obviously pure speculation, but I can't imagine they're going to bring mercenaries in late and then not give you anything for beating it. So hopefully, oh shit, almost walked into that. Hopefully we see the PRL. Um, I have a feeling that we're going to see something at least. Oh no! Fuck. This? One down. Yeah, you dumb bitch. I hope they add separate ways to Man, I don't really give a fuck about a flamethrower. I hope they don't add a flamethrower. I mean if they do, cool, but not in, oh my god. Not in replace of uh the PRL. Welcome to the stream, Francisco. Um, I doubt they're gonna recast Ada, but I do want to see separate ways. All right, I'm about to disturb this guy's peace. Man, shitting all over the floor in here. Jesus Christ. They made the flamethrower playable in game. That's interesting. Um. Huh? I guess we'll find out. I just don't see... Uh, a flamethrower just doesn't really fit in this game. There's nobody weak to fire except for one boss. And I don't even know if he's weak to fire in this game, to be honest. Am I missing anything in here yet? There's a key over here. No, that's not the key. Sir. Where the fuck is the key at? Oh, it's upstairs maybe? I can't fucking remember. No, I guess it's still downstairs. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Is that not it? Oh yeah, I forget that there's no fire grenades. I kind of forgot about that. So yeah, I don't know if Mendez is weak to fire because we didn't really get to test that out. Luis is in mercenaries, Leon's in mercenaries twice, Ada's in mercenaries twice, um, Wesker and Hunk. I don't know, if, is Krauser in it? Is Krauser in mercenaries? Bruce Seconder 1, I've got that. Mayhem mode, what's, a, what's the mayhem mode? I haven't heard of that. Uh, no, I haven't farmed the game at all. Um, this is pretty much, this is pretty much the, uh, only time I've played the game since my stream ended on Sunday. Um, where in the fuck is that key? Oh, it's just sitting right there. Dumbass. You too, huh? <laughs> Gr 
Krauser is a mercenaries. That's good. Take care of yourself, buddy. I do like Ada's. Oh my god, I almost ran right into that. I do like her design. Um, I like everybody's design in this in this game. I was kind of worried about some of them, um, but everybody looks a little bit more realistic, I guess. You know, as realistic as a video game character can look. It's upstairs. Mayo Moan is an ability that all characters like have. Like Hunk has infinite ammo when Mayo. I don't. I don't know what that means, but, you know, we'll just wait and see what happens, I guess. I'm eagerly awaiting for Mercenaries. I think, I don't, so I play, I'm going to stream tomorrow, playing on it. I'm going to plan on streaming maybe one day this weekend, but we're getting severe weather again, so I'm not really sure how much streaming I'm going to get done uh, this weekend. If the fucking power goes out again for like four days like I did last time. But... I think I can finish this playthrough. Um, oh, fuck. I am not good at parrying. Fuck you. I think I can finish this playthrough in three, three sittings. I mean, it's only seven hours, so I kind of have to finish it in three sittings. Ooh, I fucking parried that bitch. Oh. Leon Thirst videos. I think your TikTok is, uh, is an algorithm based on what you like, so I think you did it to yourself. Where was all the simps for uh, this game back whenever I was a kid? Like, whenever Resident Evil 4 was around, whenever I was, like, fucking 13 or 12 or however old I was, uh, nobody gave a fuck about this game. Everybody was too busy playing Modern Warfare 2 and shit. I was a dork for, like, Resident Evil back, uh, back then. Oh, fuck. You ain't getting me, motherfucker. stayed in here I have something I think you uh, oh fuck yeah I'm gonna die a lot at Del Lago if I die don't press don't press continue time won't reset to save file oh okay that's good that's a good tip uh, no I don't have the prime uh, primal knife yet I haven't uh, played much of the game I want to okay I gotta sell three snakes Welcome. after I beat oh, I the game on professional you. through this stream I'm going to go back well, and play the game uh, <laughs> a couple more times to kind of get my bearings because there's a couple of uh, videos I want to make but I need to I need to just play through the game Whenever I make the weapon showcases, I want to get a good feel for the weapons Church. for uh, yeah. before I uh, start making a showcase on them, because it would be kind of disingenuous to make a showcase on a weapon I don't know anything about. Now, to hold everybody over, including myself, uh, I am going to make some videos regarding the weapons, but it's going to be a little bit different out, outside of my... Uh, wow, did I think that was... That's what I was looking for. It's going to be a little bit different than what I normally make. But nothing crazy. Like five-minute videos. Weapon-related. 
But I'm going to do my weapon showcases like I normally do. I just don't want to rush it. Have I uh, got the Dipman charm? Yeah, I got that charm. I got lucky. I got it pretty early. Damn it. Gundar one to roost. The church is. Do I like the Krauser knife fighting or the normal knife? Negative. I would say I like the new one. Oh, I mi I misread your comment. Um, I haven't really used Krauser's knife that much, to be honest. I thought you were asking me if I like the Krauser knife fight in this game more than Resident Evil 4. Um, but yeah, I haven't really used the the uh, fighting knife. I still got it in here. Okay, I need to use some of this shit. My inventory is a mess. It's a good thing that I'm kind of stocking up. Yeah, I didn't know how hard it was to get. Apparently, a lot of people are having trouble with it. But I got it on, like, my first try. I, well, not my first try, but I put three golds in it, and I got it. Um, first try with that. And then I thought, like, oh, so you use three golds, you're going to get something good. And then the next time I put three golds in it, I got, like, absolute bullshit. Let's hope for no more surprises. Go ahead and save the game again, just in case. I'm honestly going to save my knife upgrades for the primal knife, uh, for the indestructibility. I think that is absolutely goaded, even if it didn't do any damage whatsoever. It is worth it. So I'm not even going to, I don't even think I'm going to upgrade Krauser, Krauser's fighting knife. Come on, guys. Sell tra yeah, I did get that uh, achievement. I sold the Salazar crown. If you max out the Salazar crown with each each uh, thing... So let's take a look at it. If each color is different, you get uh, that achievement. Because it will be worth... It'll be worth uh, 100k. Now I'll put the yellow in because this is more common. Uh, or I need a I need a red, uh, whatever the fuck that is. I don't know if there's other treasures that are worth 100k, but that's the one that I used. Hey, buddy, hop off. Did he actually hop off? Yo, he really did. Yeah, the merchant does sell the red. Uh, with spinals. Alright, I need a fucking heal or something. But also, I felt like they're a little, they're more con those red squares are more common than um, the uh, yellow, the gold diamond. Bought the stock for the TMP. I haven't bought that yet. As a matter of fact, I don't. I haven't really used the TMP. I bought the fucking um, whatever you call it. The well, I didn't buy it. It's a free weapon, MP5. And I haven't even upgraded the MP5. 
The TMP does more damage, but the MP5 does... Did I just pick that up? No, I picked up another ruby. The TMP does like 1.5 times, or it does 2 times, something like that for the exclusive. And the uh, MP5... The TMP does 2.0 damage. 2 times damage. And the... MP5 does piercing. It's either 2.0x or 1.5x. I'm not really sure. Alright. I see you took care of a request. Well done. <laughs> nice work. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. I'll buy almost any. Well, come back any time. So this is actually where I in, uh, quit. Uh, you can see right here, same area. And I got, what, 38 minutes? So that's doing better than what I was doing. I'm not gonna fuck with that puzzle. Has better spread and pierces, but deals less damage. So, what's your what? What do you think is the better weapon, uh, the MP5 or the uh, TMP? Just overall, just curious. Use the smaller knives and save on durability of your main knife. That's a good tip. Alright, now we're going to the fish farm, I guess. I never knew this was a fish farm <clears throat> fish farm until I started playing this game. It says it on the map. Maybe it says it on the map in Resident Evil 4, I don't know. But Hey buddy. Missed all my shots. All right, where's the uh, next one over there? Did the motherfucker not die? There we go. Body armor's not looking great. Die, please. Oh, I'm gonna start taking real damage after my body armor does. I kind of forgot. That I had it. All right. All right. Where is the next one? Did I not pick it up? Guys, right up on my ass. Where is it? Oh, don't you do it to me. Okay. 
I'm looking right at it apparently. It has to be behind that wall. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of a catch-22. It is a waste of time, but at the same time, I do want to get enough money to be able to purchase the damn thing and max it out. But if I stand around here and I fucking try to pick everything up, I'm probably going to run out of time. This damn thing's bothering the fuck out of me. Where the hell? Oh, there it is. I don't need that. I'm not going for that treasure at all. Took my little pea brain forever to figure that out. No, by all means, if I'm struggling trying to find a damn blue medallion, just let me know where it's at. Uh, fuck. I got too much shit. What's the fucking other one? Oh, it's below me, isn't it? Okay, well, I'm just gonna miss that one. Wait a minute, did I get what I needed? Uh... No, I didn't. I need a fucking jerry can. I was so preoccupied, worried about that fucking blue medallion. like that bitch. Alright, while well, I'm down here, might as well go ahead and take a look. Hmm. Oh, well. No, uh, there it is. Please. For our, both of our sake, just fuck off. There we go. One of my biggest gripes, I can uh, agree with you on that, is um, the bloom on the weapons just absolutely pissed me off. There's abs there's no need for bloom on my weapons that, like, I shouldn't be missing shots that I'm aiming right at them just because you want to put bloom on it. That has bothered the hell out of me. Alright, the last one is under- it's right here, yeah. I remember that. Last one. Where in the fuck? I gotta go to the typewriter. I'm gonna save before I go fight Del Lago, because I am gonna die. Why don't I use auto sort? I did not know there was an auto sort, to be honest. My next playthrough, I'm going to try either the SG or the 5.7 because of that. I want to see what the laser sight is like. So that's a <laughs> I knew I could count on you. I got something new for you. Where the fuck are the... Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price, well, that's art. 
This is what I'm talking. Pleasant trap. Oh, I didn't uh, upgrade my body armor. Oh well. Let's get this bread, fellas. First try. I was really hoping they would take this uh, fight out. I'm not gonna lie. Did that hit for a while. Swallow me whole, huh? He's gonna try. Too busy fishing treasure and I am trying to kill the motherfucker. Oh my god. <coughs> I'm not sure if uh, the chat allows links or not, to be honest. I've had somebody ask me that before. I'm not really sure where that, how that ended up. Might just block, might just be blocked. Fuck out of my swamp. Where do you go? Where'd you go? Oh. Alright, let's kill this fucker. I don't want to do this again. Okay, I get it, my guy. It's a big fucking salamander. Yeah, you can try to post it, I don't mind. So do I have to go all the way back to the main menu? Yeah, I know I can move to the left or right, I just suck. Alright, let's try that again. I always struggled in the first game um, dodging the fucker because sometimes he just pops up out of nowhere. But this game, I think, does a pretty better job at um, telegraphing where he's going to be at.
Oh, put some fucking elbow grease into it, Leon. I'm not gonna lie, this was one of my least favorite things to do in Resident Evil 4. Dude, I didn't even beat Verdugo, I just ran. He kicked my fucking ass. Leon, throw the spear at the fucking monster! like the world's worst fucking like lazy river or wave pool no oh that was close can you please dive my god please That sounded like that hurt. Get your ass up. Man, the water's fucking wonky. Again? Really? We're doing this again? happened to me last time. I'm not sure how I got hit considering... Okay, fuck him. What weapons did you uh, use on hardcore to beat the game or beat those bosses pretty easily? Zero deaths. <clears throat> so I got what, an hour into it? That's not bad. I feel like we're Sacrificial getting pretty lamb. far in the village. Fifty one minutes. Condor.
All right. I agree, Leon. What is this place? <sighs> Some kind of shrine. It's the lake. It's the lake? this quick so let's see I think the gold chicken egg is over here it's one of these two now I need to go there and behind me I'll do that one last It's a triple squigglies. That thing and that thing. Okay. So oh, that's sad. Yeah, the bloom on that broken butterfly is pretty bad. Alright, well there's another fucking treasure. Where's it at? I heard it. I'll just pick it up. I'll pick it up. Where's it at? Oh, never mind. I guess I won't. It's a little... Alright, I wasted time. Let's go. I'll fucking go get the chicken egg. The spinals are, um... Something I definitely want to stack up. Is that the treasure? No, the treasure's right here. Not much of a treasure, but okay. Yeah, I'm actually kind of curious about the Killer 7 in this game over the Broken Butterfly because of the laser and the um, critical 5. Uh, it says something about 5 times critical headshot bonus or critical bonus. That seems like it might make up for the uh, overall raw power of the Broken Butterfly. I 
I haven't even used the uh, bolt action in this game, so I might give it a, uh, give it a try. The bolt action and the OG was pretty bad, so I just didn't even bother. Well, I know you got the present for me. Free. That thing, where's the other one at? Over here. Yeah, it's over here. Um, so this one? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Excuse me while I reload. Now I need to turn my ass around. That's so hard to turn, Leon. Just turn the boat. I don't remember which one's which. I guess that worked. Now I need to go... Back on the boat. And go to the... Merchant. Which will be... Here, I guess. Then we get the first boss, I suppose. I think the biggest winners in the game Bolt Action Killer 7, SG09, and the Punisher. Every gun with the laser sight is just much better. I haven't used a laser sight, so I'm gonna have to give it a try. I 
have something I think you love. Welcome. I've got something new for you. Might want to take care. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Welcome. Ooh, what you buy it? Good luck to you, stranger. Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> it's not here, is it? It is here. All right, Elegante Tom. All right, let's go. Don't hit me, don't hurt me! No! Fuck! You hurt me! You gonna put some pep in your step. I like how this thing has fucking teeth. Where's my dog at? There he is. I don't know if I got a screenshot of that the first time or not. Hey, it's that dog. Oh no, oh no, I was, I was talking too much shit. I think he's a little mad. Well, that wasn't too bad. Kind of used a bit of ammo, but I'm not too worried about it. Mostly just fucking missing every shot with the pistol. Goodbye, my friend. Where are you at? Thanks, bud. Can't even pet the dog. What kind of game is this? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to give. Oh, did I not get that treasure down there? No, I did not. Oh well. I'm gonna have to give one of the laser sight weapons a chance next playthrough. Right now, I'm not gonna waste any money on upgrading any other weapons. Um, I'm gonna just. Uh, 
focus on the weapons that I have now. And I already have most of these upgraded all the way anyway. I don't got time for that. It's one hell of a key. Ashley Graham, I'm here to help. Oh shit, I'm gonna have to fucking like pre Google the uh, puzzle that we have in the island with the regenerators running around. That thing really fucked me up. Oh, we're getting there. Why am I struggling with this? What the fuck is wrong with me? Am I really having a hard time? There we go. Wait, what? Okay, what the fuck? Ashley, you in there? <clears throat> Ashley. I can agree with that. Seriously? Just bought this. Get the ladder. Yeah. Um, okay. What do we do? There's no way out. Come down here and get that. Thanks. Roost, I've secured baby. Like I said, it's dangerous. Stay close. Fuck it, we ball. All right, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, we ball. Look away. Some 
new good welcome. What can I interest you in? Fucking uh, again was right about the weather. The uh brain stopped working. Cabin. Right around the corner. Back to sleep, big guy. Oh, I forgot to sell him my golden egg. Do I have to catch her ass? No. Okay, everybody's gonna do that to me. Ninja Cats, welcome to the stream. Ashley! Close your eyes. You okay? Yeah. He just gets smacked by his own pig. Ashley. Uh, why did I just save right here? Am I gonna go for cat ears after this? Probably not. I think I'm gonna go after this. I'm gonna try to get the hand cannon. Cause I still need to get an S plus rank on hardcore. I'll go for the uh, S plus rank on professional soon. I just don't know when. Yeah, cat ears is S plus on professional. And what the fuck do the cat ears even do? Like, does anybody know? Because I, I genuinely do not know. I mean, what do they do other than make you look really cool? I mean. Grenades. Maybe I'd need to figure out that auto sorter yeah. thing. Now, 
good to go. Lighten up. You can fuck off, please. Get your ass back down there. a good parry. <laughs> Fuck off, leave me alone. Getting bullied. Yeah, you can only perfect parry on pro, and I'm not good at parrying. I'm gonna invite you up here. Get the fuck out of my house. Man, they all just want to do it to me, huh? You don't get off my fucking ass. Use up quite a bit of resources, but no deaths. I was kind of I, I kind of thought I was gonna die in that cabin at least once. I just want to be on track to complete the, this um, village in two hours. This is real. Let's go. What's, what's going to happen to me? Right now. Let's just focus on getting out of here. Yeah. Right. 
fast, fast, the little lambs are escaping. That's what they're saying. I've got some new items in stock. <laughs> Welcome. I got something new for you. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Pleasant trap. Yeah, I just gave away our position, my bad. Guess we're doing this. Man, they're they're just throwing these fuckers at me all over the place now, aren't they? We just gotta fucking go. Alright, what a load. Um, I don't really like the start that I'm on. Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, straight up. You're a real professional. Don't get yourself killed now. Doing this. Oh, fuck, I was really just standing right there for me. Great. Oh, my God. They're just, they all fucking swarm.
It must be kind of weird having this game come out and the language that they're speaking, like, there's, it's just not right. Whenever I was, I mean, I still don't really understand what they're saying, but I sure as fuck didn't know what they were saying back whenever the game came out. And these small grenades are weak as fuck. Out of the way. Bro, you just want it fucking excuse, didn't you? About to fight the chainsaw sisters, I use up all my grenades. Sure is quiet. This is going to be an interesting fight. I saw that dude on YouTube kill him in one second with the mine thrower, but do not have that weapon. Some for 3k? Damn, I didn't know that. The yellow herbs. Great. I am flattered. Give him a one lady type of guy. I wish everybody would just kind of hop off my nuts for a minute. Whoa! 
Are you fucking kidding me? I really fucking blaze through that only to get fucking quadruple tapped by the entire fucking village. <sighs> Fuck off. Motherfuckers. Yeah, the Molotovs in this game are just ridiculous. Wait a second, when I reload my save, it doesn't it say it's, I'm at 123.26. Huh. So the whole time I kept reloading that save, it didn't do anything. I gotta go all the way back to the fucking main menu. I guess that's nice to know now. your fucking fat ass down well I knew like Tom in the inventory and the merchant counted but I didn't know reloading a save count it unless I quit out honestly me dying to the Bella sisters was probably a good thing because I reloaded the save a dozen times oh my god of course I run into that again but if that not if that didn't happen I probably wouldn't find out about it and plus I probably just save myself five minutes so <sighs> the 
fuck was in here? I don't remember. Hey, get off my fucking nuts! Shit, my body armor. I guess I should probably save the game. I don't want to do all that bullshit again. surprising I am flattered, but I'm a one lady type of guy. Disagree with you, Leon. That was too easy. Shotgun ammo. Oh my god, don't catch on fire. Just pick up the fucking ammo. Leon, Leon, Leon! Pick up the fucking ammo. This isn't your first time running from creeps. I can't tell if that's meant to be a compliment. So my goal is two hours in the, in the village. Let's see. 
I know we're getting closer to the end. Yeah, I think you three would probably be an ADIS DLC. Right. Oh, fuck. Hurry. Don't worry about them. So Mendez is up next, I You're think. You're the one he wants. If we see him again, you run. B what about you? Yeah, I noticed the uh, U3 document in the castle. Oh, I have something up. Like. Right, an hour 30. Welcome. I've got something. <laughs> Suit yourself, stranger. An hour 30. You know what? Hang on. He has some uh, problems with the flaming stuff. Yeah, I don't. I don't feel like I had that much of an issue on hardcore, but I could be wrong.
guess your tap dancing days are over. Mendez. their attention. Let's keep moving. Uh, Leon, I'm not gonna turn into one of them, right? I won't let that happen. It wasn't too bad. All right, so we made it to the castle. Two hours on stream, but I think it was about an hour and a half in game time, so we're on a good pace. My goal was to get here in less than two hours. We got here in less than two hours, so. hour and a half all right so i'm gonna go ahead and end the stream here uh we'll pick up tomorrow if the weather doesn't get too bad and um i'll try to beat the castle in one stream as well it'll probably go longer than two hours maybe three maybe even four hours the castle is usually the longest part for me um so i'm gonna go ahead and end the stream i appreciate you guys for hanging out with me over the last couple hours and so far we're on a good track let's keep it up uh not yeah uh, the castle is kind of a difficulty curve so we might have some issues here, but, you know, I guess we'll find.